Uh, I'm uh, Councillor Derek Loudon, representing uh, Tain and Easter Ross uh, on Highland Council. And what we were doing today was uh, we were involved in uh, a participatory budgeting event, um, deciding how the award discretionary fund in Tain and Easter Ross would be divided up. I think it's a, it's been a, a useful event. Um, you know, in the past, uh, sometimes um, there's been uh, some doubt as to how the World Discretionary Budget was uh, divided up. So this gave the community an opportunity to come along and decide where a certain part of it was going. And I think that's a good thing. I think it's a good thing to involve local people in making decisions. Um, and that way, hopefully, you're going to end up with more happy local people because they know how the money's been divided up. I'm Alistair Wright, councillor for the Tain and Easter Ross Ward. Well, it worked to officially, you know, the, the groups have to fill in an application form, quite a simple form. These forms are evaluated, and uh, I think all the, meaning if all the forms went through because they were all eligible, and then the groups come forward, they present a, a case, two minutes, and then time for questions from the public at large gathered here today, and then, you know, the people then vote on what they think, they have seven votes, so they voted them what they think was the best ones that enthralled them, you know. Okay, I'm Fiona Robertson, Highland Councillor for Tain and Easter Ross, and we're in the Duthick Centre in Tain, um, running our participatory budgeting event today. I thought it was really good, um, it went very well, it was very smooth, very well organised and I think we had a really good representation of Tain but also of all our seaboard and surrounding villages were well represented so that was always a worry that you know it could be predominantly Tain but the seaboard villages and the other villages were well represented um, and, it, and it seemed to go very well, everybody seemed to be really delighted with it all and it was a lovely lunch. And I think a lot of people met other groups they hadn't met before, so there was a lot of networking went on. Um, and a lot of people have, I think, teamed up and seen how they can help one another in the future.